Hi there, my name is Chanel and I'm a happiness engineer here at Flocknote and I want to walk you through how you can send a note to part of a group. Maybe you're on the staff and you want to work with other staff members to send a birthday gift or a card to someone on the staff and you don't want them to know. First of all, look at you being all sweet, way to go. Second, it's super easy. We have our new filter and bulk action tool which makes this a snap. So if you are super admin, you could go to the everyone group. That's a great way to cast a wide net and start with everyone. But I know I am a group admin for the staff and that's who I want to contact. So I'm going to click on that group, then the people tab up at the top, and that'll load the contacts list within this group. Let's say that Clark is the one with the birthday. Happy birthday, Clark. I want to leave him out. So I'm going to use the filter and bulk action tool, this purple button right here and that'll pop up a list of criteria. I do want to clarify that the personal info, contact info, and groups options are available to all Flocknote admins. This is a completely free thing that we've just added as an updated feature, so no cost to you to add that on. Um, and then the households and giving options are only available if you have the add-on subscription of Flocknote people. So in case you're working and you don't see those options, that's why. You can check out more at flocknote.com people if you're interested in that. For now, we're going to start with the basics. I want to kind of round out and get everyone. So I'm going to click on personal info, first name, has a first name, click on or, personal info, first name, does not have a first name. Anyone that has a first name or doesn't have a first name, that's basically everyone. So I've quickly gathered everyone in this group. I'm then gonna deselect Clark Kent because I don't want him to know that I'm emailing everyone else. And then I'm gonna do action button, click that, and then you can send an email or send a text. I'm gonna go for an email. Let that load and as you'll see, it selected everyone in the group except for Clark Kent. And this is super handy, especially in a large group where you don't want to manually enter in every single person's name one by one. It's quickly gathered them all together. And since I'm sending it to individual people, I can change who it's from. So I'm going to put my name and then subject, Shh, birthday surprise for Clark. And then I can fill that out. Also, because I'm sending this note to individual people instead of the staff group, remember that since Clark isn't in this group, it technically doesn't count as me sending it to a group, it counts as me sending it to individuals. This note will not be housed in the staff group. Instead, it'll be housed in the My Notes uh, tab, which I can show you here. Let's pretend I previewed that and sent it, but for now I'm gonna exit out, the little X in the corner, discard, that was just a test, you would find it on the My Notes tab right here. So I hope that helps. There's a lot of different ways you could play around with this tool. So I encourage you just, you know, start plugging and playing and find different ways that you can use this at your particular church. If you have any questions, send us an email to help at flocknote.com and we're always happy to help. God bless.